This was my room last year. As you can see, it's very unorganized and the color is not harmonious at all. It's all over the places. Just like my thought last year, it's all over the places. Kahit ano na lang, i-design mo. But now, as I get older, I know exactly what I want and what makes me happy. This pandemic encouraged me to learn more about myself, what makes me happy and what makes me not. Things to let go and things to change. As you can see from this video, this room was in hot mess. All because of my impulsive decision in buying things. Fast forward to now, I learned it in a hard way. I spent a lot of money, but now I realize that less is more when it comes in designing your room. I'm sorry if it took so long for me to upload this video, but for this video, I'm gonna show you a piece of myself. This is where I spend most of my time. So, sabi nga nila, your room is the reflection of yourself. So, tara, samahan nyo ako as I tour you around sa aking small, humble room. Your room is the place where you start and end your day, whether you are aware of it or not. Most especially this past few months, we spent most of our days inside our home. So, I will share with you design ideas that can transform your room into a more calmer and happier room. Number one is to find the right spot. As you can see on this particular space, there's a lot of things going on because here is where my son normally do his online class and I normally do some paperwork and stuff. So, halos lahat ng kailangan namin at kailangan namin basahin ay lahat nandito. Very important din na mabango ang kwarto nyo. Iba-iba naman yung definition natin ng mabango. For example, I love coffee scent. It makes me feel relaxed. Sabi nga nila, scents builds into a powerful story that can affect our emotions. And number three on my list is to embrace soothing shades. A fresh coat of paint can be the biggest mood changer in a room. Thank you talaga ako dito kay Papa kasi every time na may gusto akong peg or gawin na paint, lagi siyang nandyan dahil isa siyang magiting na pintor. So, napapakinabangan talaga namin yung talent niya, even on his old age. As you can see, yung floor namin ay color gray. Pinalitan ko yan from wood color, brown into gray. Kasi parang nasasakitan ako sa mata dun sa color brown at saka hindi siya mukhang malinis. And also, yung aming... Uh, walls are all in gray, so it's soothing and it's very neutral. I also put a fake plant doon sa wire ng aircon kasi sobrang sakit niya sa mata, color orange. So, ginawan ko lang siya ng paraan. And this is one of my favorite, let the light in. Sun-filled rooms makes us feel invigorated even when we're stuck doing chores. To maximize the natural light in our rooms, keep curtains and drapes. Altogether, if privacy isn't an issue, I'm not a fan of blackout curtain anyway. I'm a biggest fan of natural lights, kaya bet na bet ko talaga ang mga sheer, lace, and very light na curtain. As you can see, accessible yung kwarto ko ng terrace ko, or ng terrace ko ng kwarto ko. Isa yun sa mga nagustuhan ko dahil... First of all, press ko, natural light. Pag gising ko sa umaga, alam kong maliwanag na. And then, pag matutulog kami, alam kong madilim na. Dahil, makikita ko yung natural light. Doon mismo sa bedside ko. Another advice is surround yourself with things you love. If stuffed toys and vases make you smile, then by all means, decorate with your favorites. But, do it in a smart way that it won't look messy and all over the places. Remember what Marie Kondo say? Does it spark joy? Another favorite that I'll give you as an advice is pop a plant in every corner. Caring for plant is an act of compassion. Yes, tama po yun. And the more compassion we have in our lives, the better off we are. I'll make a separate video that you can put indoor and easy to care plants na pwedeng-pwede sa bahay mo for giving sa low light and all and even your a plantita wannabe kayang sumurvive next time na yon
Kahit na may harmony yung color ng peg mo sa room mo, don't forget also to pick up with colors. Para hindi naman boring, sabi nga nila accent colors. Diyan na rin yung study table ni Forth, and dyan na rin yung vanity table ko, and at the same time, yung work table ko. As you can see, maraming laman yung ilalim dahil nandun lahat-lahat ng kailangan namin. Yung side table ko, or yung side cabinet ko, ay ginawa ko lang yan. Binalutan ko lang siya ng white wallpaper dahil ang color niya is very off sa aking room. Kaya binalutan ko siya. Before, it used to be color wood. Yung wood yung texture niya. Hindi ako nasiyahan, so kailangan ko siyang palitan. Create a good flow. As you can see, I live with my son and these two cats lives with me as well. Dito yung room din nila. Kwarto rin nila to kasi dito rin sila natutulog tuwing gabi. So I make sure to create a good flow for us sa aking sa aming magina and para sa dalawang fur babies na to. Kaya I'll make sure na lahat ng kailangan nila ay nasa isang side and I'll make sure also na hindi siya nakakaabala sa amin as human. We take care of our pets, same as a family member. Plants, plants, and more plants everywhere inside my room. Remember what I said earlier? Put something that will make you happy. And plants does makes me happy, as well as my cats. As we know, pets can't express what they need, so they are very dependent to us. Caring for a pet requires kindness, understanding, and compassion. And kids can learn to extend these qualities to others through their interaction with their pets. These two fur babies bring so much joy into our family. Kahit ganyan lang sila, pero nakakapagpasaya sila sa amin. And taking care of plants as well as pets will make you a more better person. ko yung iba sasabihin maraming kalat, maraming balahibo yes, totoo yun pero on my next video I will show you kung paano ko na maintain yung cleanliness most especially kung may kasama kayong hayop or mabalahibong nila lang sa inyong kwarto or sa inyong bahay Having a pet at home can really help your child in so many ways. It gives so many lessons and learnings in life. And my favorite among them is about compassion. And the last on my list is get your best rest. A great night's sleep doesn't happen all on its own. It's an effort. You've got to create them. A relaxing aroma and a nice light will do. Minsan sinasabi nyo ba sa sarili nyo after a long and tiring day at pag uwi nyo sa bahay, Ay, I miss my bed. I miss my room. Because our room should give us comfort and not anxiety. It should be a comfort zone from a noisy and stressful world. Thank you for watching. Good night.